Hi folks, this is Victor and it's DIY time again. And today I'm replacing spark plugs on this 2008 Camry. But this process will also work on any other Toyota, Scion or Lexus with 2.4 liters four-cylinder engine. First, you'll need to remove two 10 millimeter bolts holding the engine cover. Next, remove the engine cover. Next, remove four 10 millimeter bolts holding the ignition coils. You can remove the first two coils without disconnecting the wires. And to remove last two coils, you'll have to press the plastic tab and disconnect the wire harnesses. Before removing the spark plugs, make sure to check if there's any debris or oil inside the spark plug well. Otherwise, that stuff will get inside the cylinder and cause some problems later on. If you do find oil in your spark plug wells, then it's probably time for you to replace the valve cover gasket and spark plug oil seals. Looks like I'm going to be doing that on this particular vehicle very soon, so if you want to know how it's done, please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned. Also now is a good time to check your ignition coils. If necessary, replace your broken or damaged ignition coils. For this engine, we will use 5 8 spark plug socket. Next, we're going to remove the old spark plugs. Toyota Maintenance Guide recommends replacing spark plugs at 120,000 miles. These are still original OEM spark plugs that came from the factory, so I'm going to stick to those and I'm going to replace them with the same exact brand and model for the perfect fit and reliability. Also, this brand doesn't require any additional anti-seize lubricant because they come with special protective anti-seize coating. This is Denso SK2 OR11 spark plugs and I'm going to put a link in the description below this video where you can buy them. Now we're going to install the new spark plug. Make sure you always thread them in by hand to avoid cross threading. Also, it is very important not to over tighten the spark plugs. Turn them no more than a quarter of a turn after you thread them in and they're snug inside the cylinder head. Repeat the same steps for the rest of the spark plugs. After you're done, put everything back together. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and have a nice day.